Hey everybody, it's Margaret. Welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. And today I have a jewelry bag to unbox or unjar or unbag, whatever we want to call it. I have a giant jewelry bag. This is the other one. If you caught the one I did that was a two-parter, this is the other bag I bought at the same time. So we might find some of the mates from the earrings because there were a lot of really cool earrings in there. So we may find the mates for that. Um, and so, hi, hi, hi in the chat. I am live, so if you want to catch me live or interested in watching live um, jewelry, jar, unboxing, or whatever, I do a lot of live videos, then uh, hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it. And <laughs> you can come hang out. Um, so, yeah, I'm in our – we may chat a little bit about house stuff, too, if you want. <laughs> um, so I've been busy, busy with house stuff. The AC guy came today and – drama lots of drama so we're, we're just yeah <laughs> it's it's been crazy cray crazy so hello everybody oh yay lots of friend friends jumping in hello hello hey maggie and richard diva jones and julie and debbie and going on grumpy's there fancy pants and mary's there darlene hello yard sale lover i'm gonna say hi to everybody today <laughs> hey swag maven and rebecca and pamela and squash banana hey that's a new name for, for me to hear or say. And Susie, an impromptu thrift. Sorry if I missed you. Hopefully I didn't miss anybody. But hey, everybody. All right. I see some cool stuff right off the bat. So there's like a horse, like filigree. You can see there. The light's kind of bad where I am right here. It looks like it might have some like verdigree on it, um, but we'll see. All right. So I'm going to dig in. I don't have like um something to put it in oh here we go i'll put it in this no i won't put it in there all right well whatever we don't have a whole lot here but apparently i have my jars my bag of my tub full of my jars okay first thing out oh okay it's not very well then maybe it is a little bit okay so let's just look at it i think i can clean it you had a house built let's just say the builder spent time in jail after you closed oh my gosh julie i'm beginning to wonder we're finding out some things. Okay, first, uh, let me see if this lamp works. Oh wait, do I have this plugged in? I don't even have this plugged in. Let me try plugging in this lamp. <laughs> we put this together. Um, oh, thanks for pointing that out, by the way. Yes, I only have a few clothes right now. So yeah, if you've seen the same dress for a while, apologies. Uh, that's, I'm not a fashion channel sorry if that hurt your feelings ouch yeah sorry i'm wearing the same thing um yeah i just don't have a whole lot of clothes right now so okay um so there's this it's a horsey 24 years still standing oh good but as you can see like um there's some like verdigree or something on there i'm gonna have to get it cleaned up so there's that and it's got a cute little eye so i think once i get him cleaned up it'll look good okay um yeah we as far as the house go i don't know so the ac had trouble the inspector came back yesterday the, there was a plumber here yesterday um etc etc so ah there goes already no hang on let me pull this isn't that a horse cool yeah i think if i i mean the the it's not too bad. I think I'll be able to get it off and, and get it fixed up. So, um, oh, okay. No, no, it's okay. It's a little, things are a little sensitive around here. You know, I usually have a pretty good sense of humor about stuff, but I'm feeling a little sensitive. <laughs> feeling a little sensitive today. <laughs> um, yeah, we don't, have, I, I mean, we barely, we don't have any furniture. And, uh, whatever fine all right we'll get there though i'm trying to untangle this giant mess so <laughs> thanks you guys <laughs> um okay no 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 it's fine i i just took it wrong so don't worry about it don't worry about it. in the chat y'all it's cool yeah so um the the ac guys came out today while i detangle this craziness um yeah, there's there's issues because the, the the AC passed inspection. Look at that, isn't that pretty? It looks more green in person than it does in the in the light. So it looks more turquoise for you, and more green for me. Let's see if I hold it over here. Um, hey, we've actually matched my dress that I but I don't wear stuff like this normally. But that's cool. Um, 
No, no, no. I, <laughs> I, 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 I get that. That wasn't your intention. Sorry. I just, like I said, I'm feeling a little sensitive. Sorry. Okay. Ouch. All right. <laughs> Cause it's just is. All right. Um, okay. So there's this, I don't even know what this is. Okay. <laughs> it's a cork that somebody has put stuff on and like poked the stuff in and put, I don't think I could, I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> could it, would you say, I don't think this is even one I would try to challenge myself to sell. I think that'll go into a lot probably. Um, yeah. So when the, when the inspector came back, the AC was not in the same condition that he left it, you know, when he inspected it. So you think somebody would like that? Oh my gosh, really? Oh, okay. I know I saw the mate to this one in that other bag, so that's good. Um, okay, I'm looking in the chat real quick for a christening or wedding. Oh, I missed it. Okay, so then I've got an earring here that's broken, lots of bits, so that's going probably just through a lot. We've got some shells, and I know some of our friends in the group have sold different kinds of shell necklaces. I've sold a or maybe I have a lot. Did I sell it? Um, yeah, so I'll have to see about these. Cower is, are these the cowrie shells? I always get them mixed up. I always get them mixed up. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. So, I, I mean, not that I'm glad I'm not the only one, but I'm hearing a lot of stories. And then it, it come to find out, okay, so we're trying to find out if there were any, because there was a leak in the roof. So, it, and when it rains, well, it leaks. And they're, they, I think they try to cover it up, but we don't have any, like we can't prove it. We went and looked to see if they had any claims on the house and there've been no insurance claims. And then, um, so here's a little gold tone bracelet. That's cool. I mean, it's definitely gold tone, but you know, Hey, um, so the inspector, when he came back, like he, he went around on the roof and he saw where it was coming in like a vent pipe. And he was able to seal it up and it actually rained again and it didn't leak. So that's good. So that's done. That's fixed. Um, and then the plumber, the toilet downstairs was broken after we signed or after we moved in or whatever. It wasn't broken before and um, during the walkthrough and everything or the inspection. So the plumber came, fixed the toilet, but the shower, <laughs> it's like money pit. I don't know how much I told you guys before, but the shower downstairs like doesn't get hot and if you try to turn the heat on the hot water on the pipe sounds like a jackhammer in the wall and then it leaks all over the floor so the inspector is like I don't know how I missed that well, I don't know how you missed it either um, anyway so here's this necklace and I'm trying to see the lighting is not amazing so on the outside it looks pretty good on the inside it looks like some of the gold tone is rubbed off but that's that's okay. Yeah, that's what um, she said. She's gonna send. Um, so my realtor ended up paying the the plumber. He's still trying to figure out if he can fix the shower. If he can't, because of the kind of parts they used, because that because of the kind of parts they used, um, he's not sure he'll be able to fix it. It might be have have to be something we take totally out, because the um, the downstairs bedroom, the up one of the upstairs bedroom, and then the laundry room, which is in the garage was all an addition. And so we're trying to find out now if it was permitted because um, we can't, they didn't say anything about it being an addition. They didn't, I don't know. So we're trying to find out my, my realtors talking to the city, trying to see if they got permits for it. Cause if not, we may have to get a city inspector out to get it reinspected. And they might tell us to rip it all out <laughs> and redo it. So she uh, messaged their realtor and said, you haven't heard the end of this. Okay, so this is a cool ring. I need to clean it up and see if I can clean it up. But but the piece that's on there is wood. It's wood set in there. Ta-da. Yeah, so it's been pretty pretty rough. And uh, yeah, so apologies if my if my sensitivities are a bit high right now. If they are. We haven't, you know, we don't have a fridge in here yet or anything. The dishwasher doesn't work, so I tell you that. So the dishwasher guy's coming out. It's always just one thing after another. Whatever, fine. It is crazy, but we've got we got a washing machine and stuff coming this weekend, and the ADT people are coming too. 
All right, this is kind of cool. I mean, I don't know. Hmm. I'll have to look at the, because normally with stuff with like rope or string, I want to make sure that the string looks good if I'm going to sell it. So it's kind of iffy. I mean, otherwise it, it would be something I would try to sell. So that's cool. Anyway, <laughs> drama, drama, drama. Um, yeah. So I'm sure I'm just waiting for something else. That's why I want to hurry up and get the dish of the washing machine and the uh, dryer and everything all uh, so I can test it all out. Let's see what's what. Um, so yeah, this it would have to be restrung, but chances are I'll probably just put it into a lot because I probably won't restring it. But I like the yellow. Oh, it goes on my, my shirt too, or my whatever, my dress. Um, yeah, I'm trying not to let it stress me out. Well, and then the other thing is, like, I keep t I've told you guys, I'm supposed to be in Kerrville with my sister, and I'm I have repairmen and and people coming every day for the next two weeks, whether it's repairman or the um, alarm guys or. <sighs> what? Yeah, I just, yeah, karma for sure. Karma will have to fix it. Um, so yeah. So yeah, so I've told her, like, I don't know what I'm I can't come. I have to deal with this. So there's that. We'll figure it out. So there's this little cross on these beads. The beads are kind of like a green yellow color. That's cool. Uh, hi guys, hi, hi. Uh, and I'm trying, I don't have a loop with me right now because it's at the apartment, but I have a magnet and then that's magnetic. So let's see. It's more common not to have crappy. <laughs> yeah. And that's the thing. Like I, my realtor was just like, I don't even know what, I don't even know what to make of all this, this is nuts. You know, she's never, she's having to talk to people in her office and her broker and like, what do we do about all this? This is new to all of us. Yes. Okay, there's something cool here. It's all tangled up in this necklace, which is the cool thing. Hey, hey, Joni. Hey, Ruby, sorry if I'm just saying hey to you in the chat. Hello. There's some cool stuff tangled up into this giant necklace if I can get it undone. So, on the positive side, the stove works and the oven. Well, the oven works. I haven't tried the stove yet. Yes, dear. Oh, I thought I told you all the switch. Yeah, 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 switch. Sorry, sweetie. I meant to say that before I started. Haha. -ha. When do you fully move? Well, we're staying here now. Um, we we just have moved the um, our mattresses over. The pod, the first pod comes next week on Wednesday. So my magnet, I got this on Amazon. I put a link to it down below, and I think I called it the wand magnet or something. So if you look in the description. I'm trying to untangle this off of here so we can see what this is because it looks cool. <sighs> yeah, if we end up living here, yeah, and it's going to be really good. I'm just trying not to let it sour me right now. So it just, I want to cook a meal, you know? <laughs> I just want to like, but I have no dishes. I got nothing. So we went and got like salads, like HEB, our grocery store has like those salads, like instant salads and things I don't know anyway so <laughs> yeah for sure it's a lot of drama oh boy yep ah uh, it's coming it's coming there's really cool things they look like little um tendrils like from a vine or something it looks cool ah I got it look isn't that cool oh, hang on get on there right you like so look at that that's pretty cool. It needs to be cleaned. It feels kind of grimy, but I think it's going to look really cool when it's done, all said and done. Like so. Oh, it's kind of. Yep, yeah, there it is. Thank you, Barbara. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I like that a lot. This is something that I probably put at least 30 or 40 bucks on once I get it cleaned up because it's so unusual, right? So unusual. What else? Yeah, I don't know. Money. Just money. Money, money, money. It's money. <laughs> Your Goodwills don't. Yeah, I and now where I've moved, Goodwills here don't have jewelry jars either. So we'll see how it goes. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm excited about our first Christmas here. <laughs> That's only in a few months away, right? Um, yeah, we'll be in by then. Oh, look, this one has got an engraved. It says Anne on there. 
man. But I, on the inside, it looks like it might be brass or copper. And it's probably just copper and then plated. I'm trying to see if there's another mark in there. Come on. Unless she was a copper colored girl. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Julie. It's for sure it can. Oh, brother. We don't need any help in that area. Let's we'll put that right there. Anyway. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we've. Um, oh, you've been doing wire wrapping. Nice. Oh, thanks, Billy. Yeah, we went this morning. I went and got my nails done this morning. I had the boys, well, the boys had to go with me because what else are they going to do? So I let them pick the color and they picked for me. So, so this is a, I like this stone. I, I don't necessarily like the cord it's on. What does that say? Hang on. Express. But I definitely like the blue, like cat's eye type stone that's on there. That's pretty cool. You was told you were told by a good will employee that they're doing away with jewelry dry. Oh, man. They're so fun. But you know, like I went to that estate sale just the other day and I got a ton of stuff. Even those earrings that I haven't decided now if I'm gonna sell or not. Um, I got those there. So there's still stuff out there. There will be another way. Yeah, the 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 goodwills here don't even have a jewelry counter. So I'll see about that. I mean, they have sabers here, but I'm, I'm so, like, I haven't been thrifting at all. Like, I try to go garage sailing um, just because I need to get out of the house. But hang on. I'm trying. I know you can't see what I'm doing. I'm trying to get this untangled right here so I can show you. Um, but, but what was I just saying? I forgot. Garage sales. Oh, yeah. Okay, I remember now. Okay, this is kind of cool. Very neutral, like natural, like wood and this. I'm trying to tell if that's, yeah, kind of like a um, oyster type shelf. It's awfully big. Ah, okay, like so, like mother of pearl type thing, and it's in good shape. That looks pretty good. So I'll try to sell that. That's neat. Yeah, really beachy, right? Somebody for a cruise. I'm going to. Um, yeah, so I found out from the lady at the estate sale, I think I told you, that the county where I am, they don't allow garage sale signs to be posted. This is a problem for me. Because <laughs> I don't know the area. I need to find out, like, in Pearland, they had a an email list that if somebody registered that they were having a garage sale, they would send out a list. But in Pearland, people put signs everywhere, so it didn't matter. Um, but I'm going to need to find out. All right, so this one has got some stones missing, so that'll go into a lot. We'll see. They've got to have some sort of system in place. Okay, I saw the make for that a second ago. And the neighborhood I actually live in doesn't allow individual garage sales at all. You have to do it only on when they have a neighborhood-wide garage sale, which I think they do once or twice a year, maybe. The ones in the fall, once in the spring, maybe. Don't have a senior... Um, oh dear. Yeah, yeah, we have a web, we have a website for the neighborhood. I need to find out if the county does because I'm trying to get this <laughs> I'm trying to get this all separated because there's cool stuff in here. Is that an earring? Oh, that is. Okay, let's get that off because that's cool. Urgh. You know I love tangles. I love them so much. <laughs> Yeah, there, I could check Craigslist. There's the, the like different garage sale apps. Like the one I used at home, people don't use it as much up here. Because at home I used the, uh, it was called gar Garage Sailor. And here a lot more people use Yard Sale Treasure Map. So I'll have to see. This just doesn't want to come off. I'm going to have to just show you and detangle it later. So I'm hoping that this earring mate is there. Because look at this earring. Isn't that pretty? It's this... Forget the chains back here. The chains are what's tangled up. Next door app. Oh, okay. And then the earring is like that. Isn't that really pretty? Ooh, I like it. I'm going to have more earrings than I know what to do with. Oh, is it going to come off now, now that I've shown you? Yes, it is. So there's that. I'm going to set that there. Hopefully, I find the mate. And then there's like this chain with this heart pendant, like blingy heart. And a big wooden tangled mess. Um, 
yeah, I need to I need to talk to the neighbors. But my mom pointed out, what if they're like buddy buddy? You know, what if they like had beer together on the weekend and like sat out and like hung out together? All right, so there's that. That probably will go into a lot unless I find a bunch to stack together. Just put. Oh yeah, you're going to, to Disney World. Oh, congratulations! How fun. We haven't been yet. We haven't taken the kids yet. We're hoping. If all this stuff gets straightened out, we might be able to go in the fall. I don't know how far out and you have to plan it. I don't know. You bet they weren't. I bet they weren't either. There's a giant hedge <laughs> built between this house and one and one side neighbor's house. It's like ginormous, like the length of the front yard. So um, they can't even like see into each other's front yard. So I have a feeling they didn't get along. Because I don't think that was standard built in the neighborhood. Um, so there is this necklace. It's a double strand. I don't know this. This is an M. I wonder if this is Maurice. There's like a store kind of like a, it's kind of like Claire's, I think, but it's called Maurice or something like that. I wonder if that's where that's from. I'll have to find out. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to. Right. My dad wants me to find out. He's like, go ask. Nope. All right, we've got more tangles. I'm just going to show you through the tangles, and I'll deal with detangling it later. How about that? Because I want to get to some of this other stuff. Beads. All right, there's this green one all tangled in there. There's some blue yarn. <laughs> then this one, it's got, like, these amber-colored beads. That's pretty. And then this one. I see a lot of that. Um... I see an evening. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I yeah, we usually have pretty good luck with our neighbors. So hey, go over there and hit the thumbs up. That would be really nice. <laughs> that would be super nice of you. <laughs> all right, this one is the necklace, but it looks like it's all broken. It would take a lot to fix it. Um wow, this is really tangled. Well, one of these looks really cool. Oh, wait, wait, I think I can get part of this off at least. Because there's something that looks really beaded. Hopefully it's, oh, no, no, that's where all these beads are dropping off of because it was like a cool, like, not the, this, but there was like a something cool beaded, like a Thunderbird or whatever that is called again. But the beads are dropping all over the table here. So we'll just push that to the side for now. Okay. Oh, I really wanted to show this other one. So let me try to get it off. Grape cluster necklace. Thanks, Elizabeth. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry if I was a little sensitive earlier. Sorry about that. I usually have a thicker skin. Sorry. This is a really cool necklace when I get it all untangled. If you can see, it looks like just like, oh, yeah, it's just a gold strand necklace. But it's not. I will show you. It is all of these little pieces in between look like little lions. Look, ready? Is that? It's like a little lion. Can you see? So there are little lions throughout. So this will be cool to sell. All the little pieces are lions. So I would probably use Leo on there, you know, for the Zodiac Leo. Somebody that's a Leo might enjoy that necklace. It's really tangled up though. Come on now. I'm going to have to scooch. Then this will probably go into a lot because it looks yucky. Looks yucky. That's a ginormous earring. What? Whoa. That, I uh, hope the mate's there. <laughs> that's a big one. Yeah, for sure. Okay, here's another one that's like stretchy, springy, but it's broken. So that will go into a lot. Man, I really dropped beads everywhere. Okay, so far I found some earrings that don't have mates yet, so hopefully the mates will be in there. There's a broken chain. Are you far from where I used to grow up? Well, uh, it's not too far because in, in the Austin area, like Houston is like three hours. So yes, in that respect. But in Austin, I mean, it's not too bad if I was going to drive over to the Austin area to do some garage sailing. Maybe 20 minutes. It's not far. All right, so we've got a plastic rosary. 
We've got a floating cross necklace. And then like one of these, like fishing, fishing wire, they're all tangled up. Hello! <laughs> and that is magnetic. <sighs> yeah, I needed to come on and just like try to take my mind off things. But then what do I do? I just sit here and talk about it. I don't know, man. I don't know. Yeah, definitely a Darlene earring. I find the mate, Darlene might have a <laughs> might have a showing. <laughs> Make it a showing, whatever you say. Look, it's just tangled. There we go. I'll set it to the side <laughs> in case the mate shows up. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Look at this. Okay, we're gonna do this. There's just a little this. Karen, oh, Karen does. Okay, I'll ask, uh, <clears throat> I'll talk to Karen and see what she says. She's a, uh, here we go. Maybe growling at it worked. Okay, we've got another just chain. <clears throat> There's a cool looking thing on here I wanted to show you, because I'll probably give it to my sister. It's got a bee on it, if I can get it, get to where it is. Huh, okay. Well, I'm just going to show you, and I'll detangle later. There's this green thing, which is tangled up. The bead is cool, though. That's a pretty cool bead. But then this, that's on this leather. Oh, hey, there. It's on this leather piece, and I think it's, what do you guys think? Is that Jasper? It's, hmm. It's gray and white, and it's kind of like splotchy. And then there's a bee on top. See, it's a bee. This is, what is that? Um, hmm. If it was more like round, if there was more like uniform type round things, I would say it was crinoid, but it's not. Like there's a little piece on there that looks like that little part right there. Kind of looks like crinoid, but I think it's just a, I don't know. I'm gonna have to look it up. Ta da! I'll have to do a little digging on that. Okay, anyway. And then this bracelet is broken. It's all tangled up. Tangled, tangled, tangled mess. Um, let's see. <laughs> yeah. I'll have to look. I'll have to look. So, okay, come on. This one really was a. Maybe this is like. I don't know what this is doing to me today. <laughs> no, this wasn't what I needed. Oh well, maybe it is what I needed. Just to slow me down and teach me patience. <laughs> Tell me if you do this. So when you're having a hard time or when people are being jerky to you, do you go out of your way to be nice to other people? I do. Because <laughs> I figure maybe, maybe I'll get some extra karma built up. And it'll, uh, looks like a composite stone. Okay. Hmm. It's definitely, I mean, it's definitely stone. I'm going to set it aside. There. Okay. So then this is pretty cool. It's got these, oh, they almost look like onyx. You know the white onyx stone? They almost look like that. Um... Or some, I don't know. I mean, they're def the white ones are definitely stone. You can see the stripies in them. I have a feeling they're the onyx stone. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure. Like that banded onyx. Or oh. So, there's that. Okay. <laughs> you hibernate, look for positive website. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, and usually when I get stressed, I just like... I get tired. I just want to go lie down. <laughs> I don't want to, I don't know. And that's how I, my body is just like, I think it needs time to like chill and think. All right. These are cool. They're definitely like vintage faux pearl beads. They're tied. That's cool. So those will be fun. You garden. Oh, my cat's, whoa, Mimi was here early. Before I hit live, I was hoping she would still be there because she was laying on the floor behind me and she was snoring. It was so cute. Mimi's my little black kitty. And she was laying back there. on on. She was laying on her back with her big fluffy black tummy facing up and just snoring, and it was adorable. But, yeah, she's gone now. <laughs> 
She's gone now. <sighs> yeah. And it's like by the time my husband gets home, I don't know. I don't know anybody here anyway to go do something with. So here we've got some glass. It's hard to kind of see. So green glittery glass, but you can see some red like flecks in it. Can you see them? And then this red or orangey red swirl on top. Your dog is your best friend. Oh, yeah, we don't have a dog, but I'm not opposed to having a dog. There's a nice blue rosary in here. I didn't get that out. No, nope, it's all tangled in there. Good golly, you guys, I'm sorry. It's just tangled. It's just all tangled. Okay, moving on. Let's see. And this is good. It's good just to come on and talk, right? Just hang out with friends and say, hey, how's it going? Okay, so this is beaded. And then these are like some kind of ceramic or, hmm, I'm not sure. They might be plastic, these blue ones. Um, I think they would. I mean, I don't think they're fast sellers, but I'm as long as the chain and everything looks nice with them, I think so. And if it's too long, then I would just put it in a lot. All right, then next we've got this little gold chain, which I will probably just set aside for when I find a, a cute, you know, gold pendant or something to put on it. Hang on. It's not attracting to the magnet. Now, what does that mean? It just means it's not magnetic. And then I look closer to see if I see a mark. So it's I don't think it's gold for real gold just because of the way it's made. But it's always worth a try. The earrings that I had the other day weren't. They didn't look like something I thought would be gold, but then they were. So there you go. Um, oh, yeah, the green room guys. Got, I call up Chris. Hey, Chris. What are you doing? Let's go have a glass of wine, man. Okay, girl, let's do it. No, no. <laughs> we get along okay. Probably once we get settled, I might you know, try to do something with him and Whitney, but um, yeah, nah, maybe I should. I mean, what's he gonna say? No, he might say no. He might say no. Nope, I'm too busy. Can't do it. And I'll say, cool, man. That's cool. I don't need you. I don't need you. <laughs> it's all cool, man. Um, there we go. I do have a girlfriend that lives here, though. That's not true. I do. Actually, I have two. Okay, I should just shut my mouth. <laughs> I have a girlfriend that I used to dance with, like when I did swing dance. This is pretty. They're plastic, but they've got this kind of like mar like kind of marbled look to them. Um, if you know what slag glass is, like brown slag glass, it's got like white swirls in it. It almost looks like that, like, and then cut little facets into it. That's kind of pretty. So a girl I used to dance with, she lives here. But I haven't seen her in years. But she's invited us to her son's birthday party this weekend. So we'll go to that. That'll be good. I'll see her. That's Angelique. Angelica, Lika, Lika. Anyway, so I'll do that. And then another friend of mine just got a job here. So I need to get – they haven't even – it does look like rose quartz, but it's plastic. It's for sure plastic. Um, bye, Susie. Uh What's I saying? Yeah, a, a, another friend of mine just got a job here, but they're they're in our shoes. Like her husband is still in, in the Houston area with their daughter, because he's got to find a job now. All right, so we've got another little mm, bracelet. It's magnetic, and that's okay. All right, digging in some more. Hopefully, we're done with the tangles. I hope. Then. We've got this, it looks gross. Look, gross. I bet it was pretty once upon a time. But, yeah, so far Austin's been really good. It looks like the pearly coating has like worn off and then just got disgusting. Horrible disgusting. Okay, then these are, they feel like wood, but I don't think they are. Maybe they are. They feel like wood. I don't know. They feel like wood. Here's this. Do you ever sell designer prescription eyeglasses? I do. Yeah. Well, when I have my shops up and running, I that's one of the things I like selling. 
or they don't even have to be designer we're just prescription eyewear I, I sell those we've got a ring <laughs> And if you, I mean, you know who's good about the, that is Dorky Thrifters. I learned a lot from them, from Becky over there. There it is. Uh, hang on, I'm getting there. Oh, okay. Beauty, okay, cool. So, okay, so this is cool. It's got wooden beads, but then it also has these bright, colorful ones. So I think someone would like that. I need to fix the hoop on it, the end, the hook. Not the hook, but the the loop, the jump ring type of deal. What'd you call it? All right, there's that. And yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Check with her. Okay, so this is cute, but painful. These little silver spacers are plastic and very pokey. But hey, it's cute. It's cute. Would I sell that plastic statement necklace? Which one? You have to tell me which color. Yes. I've had a few people ask me about stuff because I, I normally do. I'll sell, you know, if you see something from the, the hall, I give you a good, you know, I give people a good price. Things have been so nuts lately. The printers at the apartment. Actually, oh, I have some. <laughs> the cake toppers that I got in that one haul. I have the cake toppers. I have them all boxed up and ready to go. And I just forgot to message her back to say, oh, yeah, I need to send you an invoice so I can send it. That's how crazy things have been. Okay, we've got three earrings here. That one is cool. If we find the mate, I will try to sell that wooden one with the is that scratched out. Yeah, it's like laser cut into it. This one is missing stones, and this one looks like an avocado slicer. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Then we have a red plastic rosary and a stretchy, stretchy. So far, there's no, like, home runs, but it's a $25 jar. So I don't, I mean, like this, once I clean it up and this, these two things will pay for the jar once I get them cleaned up and sold. Here we've got a watch. Let's see what it says on the back. Stainless, base metal bezel, um, quartz. Hang on, I'll show you, but I'm trying to see what the brand is. Ah, it's stuck. This will probably end up with my son's Phasar. This is a Phasar, part of a Phasar watch. But I always like watches that have the date and the you know day of the week and all that. Those are always fun. Um, it's missing the other side, but he's got a bunch of watches that he's been messing around with. So this may end up going into his watch stash. <laughs> his watch stash. Then we've got this plastic fleur de lis, like so. Hmm, maybe you found. Yeah. I think what happens is like the string gets messed. I find them all the time, the string messed up. Okay, I see something that looks cool. Maybe silver. Yay. Okay. I've got like this little silver ah, barrel, like barrel type bead, and then a dolphin. They look like silver. They may not. No, there's a little pull. Woo! Like so. It looks like something you get like at the boardwalk at the beach, you know, kind of deal. Hey, hey. Hello from New Zealand. How are you? I told, I don't know if you're the same person from New Zealand I talked to before, but my, one of my ex roommates was from New Zealand and she was one of my bridesmaids. Ah, oh, maybe you know her. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> so there is this little, it's like almost like a little girl. I guess it could be a, a woman's little choker. Yeah, Kiwi's from New Zealand. Yeah, yeah. Let's see, we have an earring. I'm gonna wait and see if I find the mate for it. This is, no, uh, maybe not, okay. This is in kind of yucky shape, but I like the bead on it, the, the button. So, there's, is it freezing? Oh dear, because our summer is your winter, right? Yeah, or your summer is cold. Or your, do you call it winter or do you call it summer? Right now, it's our summer. It's your summer? You sure, you sure you know her? 
<laughs> her name is Melanie. Melanie, well, it was Ginger. Melanie Ginger. Ah, oh, this was in the other bag. I remember this one. This was in the other bag for sure. This earring. Oh, yay. I'm so glad because it's so cool. Yeah, and I, this was one I was like, I'm surprised there's no maker's mark. It's really well done. So there's that. It's okay. Y'all call it winter. Okay. Then we've got this one. There, there. You were talking to you about your. Oh, okay. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> my bridesmaid. My bridesmaid. She lives in France now. She lives in France. France. But I never get to see her anymore. My Melly. The doctor that saved. Oh, yeah. My doctor growing up was from South Africa. So that was cool. Random knowledge. Dr. Sack. He was from South Africa. Ta da So that's pretty cool. I think if I can clean that little bit up right there, that string, I think that'll go pretty well. I think that's cool. It's a stretchy bracelet. So there's that. Okay. Um, the, the dolphin necklace. Um, once I get it cleaned up, because it needs a little, if I'm able to clean it up, not a whole lot. I, I would probably put about $9.99 maybe on it. Maybe. I'll see what else is out there, but probably. Let's see. I'm trying to see if I have any other mates for some of these earrings. Ha ha. All right, we've got one that's in a baggie. It's green. We've got another wooden one. See some fun stuff coming. Don't go away. So here's a wooden one. A lot. Um, I've been told if you put vegan jewelry on your on your gold, not gold, but your wooden stuff, that that's another good keyword. So, hey Mimi, you want to join us? Come here. Let's see if I can get Mimi to make a showing. Come here. She's sitting in the window cell now. Here, I'm making space for you, Mimi. Come over here. The sun is nice right there. She knows. I'm gonna grab her. She doesn't like that. I promise I won't grab you. <laughs> All right, so then there's this one. It's um yeah, it doesn't close, it doesn't have a closure on it, so I don't know. This is probably going to a lot. Come here, Mimi. Come here. Maybe I can turn it so you can see her. Let's see. You're plugged in. Oh, Mimi. Hey, Mimi. Look at the camera. No? Come here. There's my Mimi. Hey. <laughs> that's Mimi. All right, that's my Mimi. Okay, so this was in the other jar too, the other star one like this. I don't think it had a hook though, but I could put a hook on it because those big black stars, oh yeah, those will sell. That's cool. Oh, pancakes coming. You heard me talking cat. All right. <laughs> so then we've got this green like oyster shell. And a, yeah, some of this stuff is like, meh. But some of it, hang on, I've got some cool stuff. I'm trying to dig out the, she's a sweetheart, yeah. Then another shell bracelet. We've got my pancake, what you doing? Okay, oh my goodness. This one is like a silver and black bead, so it's like silvery beads. The silvery, uh, kind of like black pearl looking, silvery black pearl looking, and then faceted black ones. Stars definitely. <laughs> yeah, pancakes the one that fell off the ledge. Oh <laughs> really? Well, he jumped. I will say, he did it on purpose. So, <laughs> hello. All right. Um. So there's that. I saw. I know this earring was in the other bag as well. That one that looks like that. Sorry, the lighting's kind of funky. He's doing okay. Yeah, he, he's definitely the one that jumps off the ledge. <laughs> he hasn't been back up on the ledge at all. So I think he learned his lesson. Because Leia is the only one that kind of walks along the edge now. She walks it. None of the others, none of them are, are having anything to do with it. <laughs> so that was good. I guess Pancake uh, showed them all. All right, here we've got this orange plastic one, but it's got some missing beads, and we have a bonus here. Can you see it? Bonus here. Okay, 
We've got a little hematite pendant. Hang on, I got a mate over here for something. Then this one, I think you is like a wraparound. Is this a bracelet one or a necklace one? What do you guys think? Oh wait, is that? Every time I see this button now, because remember we found that one that it looks like this, but then there's like a name, I can't remember what it's called. Something Lou. Uh, and they, they're they worth a lot of money and they look like this. So I'll leave it to the side and look it up again. This has a little fleur de lis in it, that's cute. There. Um, yeah, Randy's doing okay. I have four cats. <laughs> I have four cats. He's doing okay. His his company just got bought out, so that was stressful. And he had already put in to go to California because he went to California the other week to see his family over Fourth of July. So he's like, "Oh my gosh, we just got bought out, but I already have the plane tickets." <sighs> right. So that was a bit of a stress for him. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool. Was this one? Oh, this was in the other one. Okay. This was in the other. I don't remember it looking like this, though. This, like, cowboy earring. Remember all the cowboy stuff in the other one? So it's got, like, a hat and spurs and boots. Was it this one or was it another one? There was something cowboy in the other one, I remember, thinking, oh, I hope the mate's there. So I'll have to look and see if I have it. You love the cats? Yeah, I love them. Oh, hey, Caroline, Celtic Traders there. We keep trying to like get a collab going and then my life is just like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, maybe later. So sometime <laughs> we'll get there. Me and then I was supposed to do uh, like interview Carlos. I was supposed to do something with Kathy Terrell and I just messaged her. I was like, I can't do it. The repairmans are coming and I can't, I don't know. I can't, I can't agree to be somewhere at a certain time right now. <laughs> a lot going on with that cowboy hearing. Yeah, for sure. Where'd it go? Oh gosh, where'd it go? It's on my pile. No, here it is. That's a lot of cowboy. Woo! I have to find out a little more about Round Rock because there's something to do with the Chisholm Trail and I need to find out exactly what. So there's that. I'm not quite sure what to make of it. It's like a little heart on a thing. Yes, I am too. Looking forward to estate sales. I, I, you know, I don't need anything, but it's good like therapy for me to go find stuff. <laughs> I don't know. And then, um, oh, thanks, Caroline. Yeah. And then I've been finding stuff for homeschooling. I've been finding stuff for the house. I'm looking for a mantle clock that chimes. So I almost bought a new one, but I know I'm going to find one and then I'll be much happier. <laughs> So then there's this cool blue bead, or it's a glass one. Could it be lunch at the Ritz? Um, there's a possibility, but I don't think so. I'll, I'm gonna hang on to it and double check, because those go for good money. No short-haired domestic, wait, I missed something. Your cat is bigger than your dog, oh dear, <laughs> Joni. You have a black cat too, right, Joni? From what I remember, you have a black cat. And there's that earring. Okay. All right. We're getting down to more, more stuffs. Ooh. Okay. I'm going to save that. I'm going to save that. I'm saving some of this for the end, for the end of it. Um, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we got Mimi and Pancake together. Mimi's been the sweetest. Misty. That's right. Yeah. Mimi has been... Such a mama's girl, like she wants to lay next to me. In, <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> she wants to lay next to me in bed and lay in the sink when I'm getting ready. And so it's it's been really good. All right, here's some little chandelier. I would take them off this card um, <laughs> because look at it. Ugh, wow, my earrings. So I would take these off the card and get some good pictures of them. I think they'll do well. If you saw them without the card, you'd be like, wow, those are really pretty earrings. And then you see them on the card and you're like, eh. <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, presentation. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I think, oh, maybe I know what that is. Maybe, maybe. Okay. Then we've got another. Oh, thank you, Caroline. <laughs> you were here earlier. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, and it, yeah, oh, I don't want to bring it up. <laughs> I'll tell you later. All right, then we've got a 
I guess it's from Red Ribbon Week, the drug-free stretchy bracelet. I think I showed y'all this. There are a few things in here that don't have mates. I wonder if there was another jar. This looks like, okay, there's this piece. But if you look at the back, you can see where maybe like a, um, a cameo, not maybe not a cameo, but like a porcelain piece that was like painted on there would have slipped in or a picture. And then where did it go? I saw the part where you would hang it or where did it go? There it is. Ah, uh -huh. see, and then you can see where like the, the jump ring part would go right there and it would hang. So that's cool. So that could go probably into a lot, but somebody could use that. Yeah. Um, yes, put them in a black velvet pouch. All right, so there's this. Is that okay, bezel? Yeah. I would want, uh... right, that's what Randy wants. He wants a Maine Coon cat. Do we have four cats already? I think we're good. Let's just hold. Let's, you got to know when to hold them. <laughs> know when to fold them. <laughs> know when to walk away. Know when to run. You don't count your kitties when you're sitting at the table. This was in the other jar, this puffy star. I remember this one. So that's good. I have another mate. Yay. And, oh gosh, some of these are broken. Darn it. So that's broken. I've got a few things I can show you that aren't broken. Hang on. Ooh, what are you? Okay, no, never mind. So I'm just like, yeah, there's some little bits that are, well, that's okay. I'd have to clean it up. Here's a Texas button. Like so. And then, darn it. There is not a mate for this one. I'll have to see if it was in the other jar. This one, I wish the mate was there, but it's not. And there were a couple others that, like, man, the mate's not there. But I'll double check the other one. Maybe I just don't remember. That might have been in the other one. Um, <laughs> you know, I wonder if the, the I wonder if they just tossed the uh, loom band bracelets. I wonder if they just check them. Okay, so these would have been awesome earrings I think I could still fix them because they look like this they both have they have circles on both sides you know so that could easily be fixed I've got a watch face it's a Timex like so be cool I'm trying to see if it's a if it's a wind I think it's a windy watch hang on hang on no, nope, maybe not. And then we've got another big ring. It's a big blingy. It's kind of small. Wait, there. It's my pinky. Paw. It's almost hmm, like Wonder Woman. <laughs> I think it would look better on somebody with darker skin than mine because it just kind of blends in to my pale skin. So I think somebody with, with more of an olive complexion or a darker complexion would Look good with that. <laughs> um, do I convert non paired some? Well, I uh, no, I haven't yet, but I've had people tell me to do that. I'm trying to think if I've done it with anything. No, I don't think I've done it yet. I have things that I would like to do that with. I'm trying to see. There's a light. I'm like, I have so many repairmen coming. I thought I was done for the day, and I see a, like a repair truck driving around out there. I'm like, hope he's not looking for me, because I think I'm done with him for today. So, okay, I think that's it. The rest is just kind of like broken bits and stuff. So I've got a little bit of a mess here to clean up. Good golly. Let me make sure. Let me make sure that I'm not lying to you. Yeah, the rest of it's just kind of like meh. That's missing a mate and all that. Okay. Bloom bands will help with the plan, that's for sure. We never found Darlene's other earring. Too bad. Well, that's because maybe she was she was in the middle of taking them off and saying like handing it to my sister. Here, Jolene, you know, you hold my earrings. I'm gonna take care of business. She got one earring off. She went to get the other one and then like wham, you know, knocked out. So <laughs> anyway, okay, so then there's this like little pendant. Do you guys know what La Chancla is? <laughs> Do y'all know what that is? 
we we were talking about that with my kids because you know that okay in the other jar I had that little keychain with the little flip flop on it and I was joking about La Chancla and the kids my boys were like what is that and so I threw it at James to, so he would know what it was and um yeah and then there's a there's a YouTube video about it and it's really really funny so anyway I don't know why that came up all of a sudden, but it just did. Yeah, it's, you know, that's how, <laughs> it's like the, the video is like how Latina moms, you know, have such well-behaved kids. <laughs> it's it's pretty funny. Anyway, so I'm going to I'm gonna look at this because this isn't magnetic, but I don't see any kind of marks on it. And I, I kind of doubt that it's, oh, well, maybe it is magnetic. Maybe part of it is. Okay, okay, I take it back. So it's good. Let's see. You have five barn cats. Aw. I don't think I should do this one either. Gosh, I'm out of it today, y'all. So there's that. This is kind of nice. That's cool. Um, oh, no. Really a person in a cat's body. Oh. Okay, so I'm going to pull this stuff down. And I think that's it for today. I... Yeah, let me know because I'm kind of I, I have some video ideas coming, but I if you have anything that you want me to address, let me know because I will do that. Because I, I I mean I can't wait till I get my shops up and running again so I can start doing sales updates and showing what I'm doing for my selling. So like huh. I mean I can just come on and talk to y'all because that's really what I need. <laughs> just to come and tell you my business and how things going. My, sis, my dad's still with my sister, if you're into that, if you're finding out about my sister. You know, she had hip replacement surgery, so he's out there. I don't think I should do this one. That's cool. Um, he's over there taking care of her. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get there to help because of all this nonsense. But she's doing okay. She's, you know, she got her hip replaced. So what you going to do? Anyway, what do you do with the broken jewelry? As of now, um, I just pile it all together. And then eventually I, I put it into a lot. I've sold a couple of lots. Um, <laughs> watch out for a chupacabra. <laughs> yeah. um, of broken stuff and things like that. So I sold a couple lots. And I'm planning on doing more. So yay. more lots. That's it as I clean up. Okay. So, yeah. Thanks for coming to hang out, you guys. Go over there and leave a... Thumbs up. And I always I always think I'm going to ask a question for you guys to leave me a, a comment in the comment section. And I always forget to think of a question to ask you. So I know. Why don't you go down there and tell me if you've ever bought a house, any crazy things that might have happened when you <laughs> bought your house? What's the craziest thing that happened? Or if you're always smooth sailing. I think I showed you that either. I'm so out of it, y'all. I don't think I showed you this brooch. <laughs> anyway, it's okay. It's all right. Um, yeah. Leave me a comment about a house. It could be a story. It could be a house that you moved into. It could be a haunted house. I don't even care. Connection. <laughs> all right. I'll talk to you guys soon. Tomorrow, probably. And uh, yeah, if you're oh oh, and if you're following my other channel, Homeschool Honey. I'm trying to get more content up there, so yeah, uh, I'll be I'll be going over there probably in a little while and trying to put something up over there. So, all right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.